an exciting announcement for us, and this involves a service learning opportunity. Now, you may remember doing service learning opportunities perhaps for your FYS class. We have built in that same service learning opportunity into this course. It is optional, so you can choose to participate or not, but if you do choose to participate, we've built in an incentive. You've already completed essay one, where we analyzed Martin Luther King Jr.'s famous I Have a Dream speech. So, if you would like to take advantage of this service opportunity, then we will give you credit for essay three. So, kind of our way of saying thank you for participating in uh, bettering our community and serving alongside other volunteers. So, if you want to do the service learning activity, this is what it would involve. I've cleared off my schedule and I've devoted my time to serving our community. And so you're welcome to join me in serving. I'll have the details below this video so that you know exactly where and when I'm going to serve and you can sign up and let me know and join me in serving our community that day. That might not work for everyone's schedule and I realize that you can choose to serve at a different day and different time with the same nonprofit organization in our community. You can also select a different organization, perhaps an organization that is near and dear to your heart or an organization that you would like to get to know more about and serve alongside. Now the service learning fulfillment indicates that you serve in the community and then you complete an academic assignment related to that service. So what we have done in this course, we have partnered the service learning activity along to the informative speech. You'll be giving an informative speech, that's our second speech for this class, you'll be giving an informative speech about an organization. So if you want to participate in this service learning opportunity, then your speech will be about the organization that you have completed your volunteer time with in the community. So it's a great way to kind of blend the service aspect of the service learning and the volunteering of our time and giving back to the community that has so faithfully served us. And it's also an opportunity to apply the skills that we're learning in class in a real life situation and scenario and be able to inform those people in our class about the organization that you selected. So if you're interested in this opportunity or you have more questions and want to know more, you can email me. And of course you'll need to email me if you're interested in serving alongside me. And you can also send questions to Sherry Holiday and I'll include her email below as well. She is our campus coordinator for service learning and she can direct you and help you find other activities or dates and times that work for you as well. I'm excited about this opportunity. I hope to be able to serve alongside several of you uh, at our date and at our organization, but uh, more importantly, I hope that this will encourage you to give back to your community.